an augmented mannequin patient simulation of a neonate patient with a congenital heart defect. This baby sim mannequin patient simulator has been programmed to model the physiology of a premature infant with hypoplastic left heart syndrome. A tracked fiducial on the tablet PC allows it to be used as a magic lens to see into the patient. When we bring the tablet close to the infant mannequin, we can see inside. From a distance, we can see that this virtual infant's skin color has a bluish tone. The skin color of a physical mannequin is difficult to change, but it's quite easy to do in the virtual world. The virtual model contains a representation of the baby's physiology. It isn't meant to be anatomically accurate. For example, we only show one lung, a simplified heart, and only one section of the systemic circulation. The emphasis is on the mental model. We can see right away that this infant has an atypical cardiovascular system. The blood coming back from the lungs gets mixed with the blood coming back from the body at the heart. This baby's pulmonary and systemic circulation are connected in parallel because the heart has only one ventricle. A normal infant has a pulmonary and systemic circulation connected in series. We can also pull up a two-dimensional schematic of the circulation. The pulse oximeter displays an alarming low oxygen saturation. A common response to desaturation is to give supplemental oxygen. It's easy to apply and any health provider can do it. Here we apply supplemental oxygen at 3 liters per minute via nasal cannula. But it isn't the best option for this patient. In the lungs, oxygen has the effect of dilating the pulmonary capillaries. This decreases the resistance of the pulmonary side to the point that most of the blood pumping out of the heart takes the lung path with very little going to the body tissues where it's needed. It takes the path of least resistance. We can see this happening in the virtual model. The lung path gets wider and more blood circulates around and around the lungs with less blood taking the other path to the body. The little bit of arterial blood that goes to the body is now highly saturated in oxygen. While the patient's saturation improves, there is so little flow that it doesn't help. The skin color gets worse and eventually the patient goes into cardiac arrest. Fortunately for her, the virtual world can be reset. The better way to treat this patient is to balance the flow between the lungs and the body until the heart can be fixed surgically. This can be done with vasodilator drugs. It's important to refrain from giving oxygen to fix the low saturation in a hypoplastic left heart patient.